Welcome back, folks, to more Curse of the Azure Bonds. Insects prepare. I parlay with them and I say I know Tyranthraxus. And she don't misspell his name. Near the entrance to this building is a crushed thrycrine. In the doorway is a ghostly shape. Do you want to enter the building? The spirit speaks, welcome, warriors. Enter and meet our queen. Two suits of armor flank this stairway, radiating faint magic. One speaks, the queen will see you. The armor seems to bow as you pass. As you approach the stairs, a voice cries out, The court gives greetings! A spirit appears before you. My heart rejoices to have such defenders. These items may help you on your quest. Alright, so what you can find here, as long as you haven't desecrated any of the graves, and we kind of came straight here to avoid all that, but you will find some quarrels. These are all blessed quarrels that you're going to want. This is a plus five light crossbow, by the way. A ring of invisibility. Uh, that's good for like a mage to have so they don't get their ass handed to them. Scroll of protection against paralyzation, I believe. A ring of protection plus two. And that staff sling is good for clot. That's a staff sling plus three. So some quite quite powerful magical items. Alas, my time is short here. My best wishes to you. She disappears. And the nice thing about those blessed quirls is they can kill uh, Roxashas in one hit, which we'll be fighting here in a little bit. I believe you can also rest here. By the way, I was just kidding. You uh, you can't rest here safely, apparently. We can, however, save. And uh, try it again. Parlay. All right, doesn't look like we're going to get away with resting here. Oops! These son of a bitches. Son of a bitches. Good thing I just saved. Well, oh, sucks for you.
Jungle Boogie. Because I have the plus three plate mail, that's not going to help. Need to give that to someone without magical armor, I suppose. Try some hold monsters. I dig it, at least it works. They're running like little bitches now. I hit him for seven damage. This is not too bad.
Let the slaughter begin! It was a good battle and we got very lucky that none of the spiders killed us outright. That's not gonna happen most of the time. pretty decent experience out of it as well. Alright, I think I'm going to make a break. You actually have to have some random battles. You have to fight about 10 random battles before you can rest peacefully in here. So it's best just to run out into the wilderness and camp. Lot of magic missiles. Stinking cloud. Wonder if I can get back to town just to get my shit ID'd. All right, cool. Get some of the stuff I need so I can do stuff with it. Ring of Protection plus two doesn't do shit for you. Doesn't do shit for you either. I'm going to sell the plus one crossbow, considering that we have plus five light crossbow. That's pretty dope. We'll buy him some, buy him some regular quarrels as well. We can sell the plus one staff sling because we're replacing that with the plus three. All right, that helps him. That gives him negative two armor class. We'll trade those to fidget. Get some plus one daggers, or excuse me, plus one darts. Ring of Invisibility, Ring uh, Scroll of Protection Against Paralysis.
All right, I want to get enough corals for our buddy here. Don't want to burn through our plus one, which we already kind of have. Now, since he's uh, wearing Elven chain mail, it doesn't look like. Oh yeah, it is. It's helping him. That's why that ring would help. No, 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 no. As long as you don't have a plus one, two, three, whatever on your armor, you should be good as far as wearing a ring of protection. I don't want to weigh everyone down with a bunch of platinum. We're just going to take 500 platinum per person. And we're going to leave the rest. With the amount of jewelry and gems that Ronstock is carrying, it really isn't going to matter. We're pretty much at the end of the game here as it is. So we'll dump the rest. The camp save. Now let's head back. In case you're wondering how come you can't hear the beating of my keys as much. It's because I have my keyboard in my lap. You are heading toward more runes. Will you travel via the path or via the woods? The Helm of Dragons reports Tyrant Thraxis to the north. We're now actually in the ruins of Mithdranor. Which is where the party from Eye of the Beholder 3 was wandering around. And this is the second to last location. There are some other optional locations. Uh, the Flan Runes, the Teshwave Runes, Oxum's Tower, but they're all pretty useless. There's not really anything worth going out of your way to get. They're pretty boring areas. Um, else I would have, of course, gone there. Uh, once you go in uh, this area here, you can no longer leave, I believe. Okay. I have no idea what this shit is. But I'm going to cast fireballs on it. There's some Orxies. Oh, Roxasha. As you can see there, immune is held to magic.
Cute little son of a bitches. What the hell is this? What the what the fuck? Some margoils? Well, at least you guys are getting to see some of the different creature types here. Alrighty then. I can't get away from any of these fucks. Look that ship flies right past my guys. Dude, you little pussy lightning bolt. Ain't got shit on me. I fucking eat lightning bolts for breakfast. Nothing. Not a damn thing. Don't even feel it. It's like sticking my fucking dick in a lamp. Not gonna happen. Can't charm my bitch.
Now, yes, I do have crows that will kill these guys in one hit. However, I'm trying to save them. As you can see, there's a lot of random battles here with this shit. As long as we keep the pressure on, we'll be good. I don't know how I ended up way the fuck over there. There's way too many fucking people in here. Anyways, we'll see you next.